ladies and gentlemen, today I will be reviewing Nope. Nope is a sci-fi thriller written and directed by Jordan Peele. So, Nope. Now you might be wondering the new atmosphere. I'm at a friend's house, so I'm just out here reviewing the films that I saw Thursday. One of the films that I saw was Nope, the newest Jordan Peele film. And I'm a fan of Jordan Peele. I do love the movie Get Out. Us had a good time with it. And I really do like him as a director and as a writer, and I think he's he's done nothing but just top-notch work. And I really do like him as a director. So let's start off with the performances. We got Daniel Kaluuya plays a staff of like films and stuff like that. He owns a ranch. Yeah, Daniel Kaluuya is great. He's a great actor. He's proven time and time again that he is an amazing actor. I mean, the film. Judas and the Black Messiah is great. Of course, his work with Jordan Peele, Get Out. He's an amazing actor, and he really did kill it in this film. I thought he did a great job. He really does that performance really well. I think his, he's very, he doesn't talk much, but just his eyes and the way he reacts to situations, it's really good. He, it's a really good performance by Daniel Kaluuya. But the star of the show, though, has to be Kiki Palmer. She's great. She has so, she is so charismatic. She is funny, she has a lot of swagger, and she's great. She's great, and I really did like Kiki Palmer in this film. I thought she did a fantastic job as the sister of Daniel Kaluuya, and I really did dig her in this film. Steven Young is very well known for The Walking Dead. He's great. He's really good in this film. He's not there for too long, but he's great. I really did like him in this film. We get a lot from his backstory, which is terrifying. There's a moment that I don't want to spoil, but it, it involves an ape. Or a chimpanzee and it's terrifying. It's one of the scariest moments I've ever seen in this film. That 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 scene really like like it, it got it was so tense. It was so tense. But yeah, he did a great job and all around the supporting actors did a great job. The guy, the worker who helps set up the cameras, he's great. He 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 really does a lot in this film. I thought he did, he was pretty funny in the film. He's pretty cool. He's a pretty cool character. All around, everybody did a great job. The cast did a fantastic job, especially Kaluya and Kiki Palmer, but the supporting actors did a great job as well. Jordan Peele directed this film, like I said, and he did a great job. I, I really did like his direction in this film. Starts off pretty slow, it, it catches up, and by the second act, you are so invested, it's so entertaining. And by the third, it's just a straight up film, and I, and I freaking, I freaking enjoyed it. I really did truly enjoy it. The atmosphere is great. I love how Jordan Peele did the atmosphere. It is terrifying, the kind of things that occur in this film. You know, there are moments that I'm watching the movie and I'm just like in such a tense moment where I'm just like, ugh, very tense. And there's moments of uncomfortableness that really, really shake me a bit. And it's not a horror movie. I'm not going to say this is a straight up horror movie. But there are moments of tense and thriller that, uh, and there's a specific moment that was so uncomfortable. I was, I was like, oh yeah. It didn't feel right watching it. It, it, it was... It was really tense. It was a very it, when it, when Jordan Peele did it, it was damn near perfect. Truly, the direction was really good. The writing, the story is very good. I really do like the story, the characters, the sci-fi elements that occur are so interesting. I truly do really enjoy just the writing and the dialogue. It's funny at times, and all around, all characters were written very well. And the creature that occurs in this film is interesting and the way they dealt with it i was like i didn't expect them to do that but it, it was really well it was really well done the cinematography is amazing it is fantastic Hoy van is great he's one of the best cinematographers he's known for don kirk and interstellar and honestly such a great cinematographer one of the best out there you can definitely see everything is shot so well it is beautiful the atmosphere and how they shoot night scenes is so well i thought the cinematography was one of the great things out of this film and it is beautiful and it's such a great watch the the shots and everything around it it's it's great i really truly enjoyed it the visual effects were top notch i never i, I didn't notice any bad visual effects at all but to be honest yeah you can definitely tell the whole thing that's going on but it's, it's so well made i i didn't even think about it and i never even thought anything bad the music is great. I think the music is always great. Hit the score. I don't know who did it, but I thought the score was really good. All around, the chemistry between the cast was all around good. Everybody had great chemistry. I didn't notice any bad chemistry. The acting was top-notch by everybody, really. I didn't really notice any like, weak spots in this film. And all around, I thought this film was great. One of the films is really an experience that you should definitely watch. I would definitely try to rewatch this again on IMAX, the IMAX screen. 
because it's a great watch and I think everybody should go watch it. And it's a film that I'm definitely going to buy on Blu-ray. I think it's worth it. And it's such a it's a film that y'all should definitely check out. If you're a fan of sci-fi, thriller and shit, you will it's a very this is the biggest Jordan Peele movie. And it's like a Spiel, a Spielberg type of film. It's very Spiel, uh, what's the word? Spiel, Spielbergian or some shit. It's it's a massive film and it gives you that feel and I and I, I really did love that. And I love some of the films that this film was inspired by. I thought all around this film was a great film and it's a film I'm definitely definitely going to buy on Blu-ray. And for that I will absolutely give this film a four out of five stars. It's a great film. I had a great time with it. Definitely definitely a film I'll buy on Blu-ray. So yeah, that is my review for the film Nope. Please leave a like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys in the next review. Peace. Yeah.